Hello. What I'm going to be doing today is demonstrating how to make a quest variable appear in a message. So I've discussed quest variables before, but I will go through them a little bit today as well in the creation of the variable. So first thing you're going to want to do is create a quest. And obviously you might have something already in mind, but I'm only using this for the variable. So I'm going to call it my variable quest. Give it priority 55 and start game enabled. I'm not going to give it a name because that's not really that important to what I'm doing. Next up I'm going to write a script. Right click new. Make sure it's a quest script. I'm just doing that now so I don't forget later. SCN, script name, um, my variable script. And then we're going to write short which defines a variable. My variable. So we'll save that script and close it. So now we're going to want to find the quest we made before, my variable quest. And in the script section, we're going to want to click down and find my variable script. So we'll still now see where it is. So at the moment, all variables default to zero. Now, in a mod that I'm making, your character has to make a large payment to another character and he pays an installment which is kept track of by this variable and so I'm going to demonstrate something similar to that in this tutorial so I'll run through the basics of the dialogue but I'm going to assume that if you're watching this you already have something in mind that you want to demonstrate so what is really important is the scripts that I'll be typing in and not necessarily the dialogue but it just depends on your own quest so anyway hello would you like to make a payment? It's my greeting. And I'm going to create a new topic, um, which I'll call Yes Pay. It's taking its time, apparently. There we go. And I'll say, let's say I said I want to pay 100 caps. So I'll say 100 caps it is. And um, we'll add a little bit of it doesn't quite fit on my screen. Um, player dot remove item caps zero zero one one hundred. And now what I'm going to do is set my very variable quest dot my variable to my variable quest dot my variable plus 100 no mistakes yeah excellent for the spell something wrong so what that does is sets the quest variable we defined before to whatever your quest variable is at the moment plus 100 so it'll always increase so then I'm going to make a new topic which is going to called, be called how much And we wait now. We wait. There you go. So I'll say I'll upload that information to your pit boy. So I'll say how much have I paid off? Um change. How much have I paid off? And I'm just going to link these two topics into the greeting now. How much? And yes, pay. So now we're going to leave that for now and head to the land of messages. And we're going to want to create a new message. I'm going to give it a unique ID, a variable message, and I'm going to hit auto display so that it just appears in the top corner rather than a message box appearing. Let's have it display for about five seconds. And now I'm going to write, and this is the important part, you have paid off. Now what you're going to write, want to write is percentage sign full stop zero F. Sorry, I got a text. Um, 
I'll look at that later. Ah, pops, probably not, very interesting. Cups. So what this little piece here that I've written, z percentage point, full stop, zero, f, that will be replaced with the value of your variable. So I'm going to hit OK and hit ignore because it's just telling me spelling mistakes because apparently zero, the letters, number zero is not a word. Um, and we get to my variable, I've already forgotten what I call my message. Variable message, there we go. I should probably write it down. My variable quest. So now we're going to go to how much. And we're going to type into the uh, result script, the important script. Show message, then now the ID of your message, which was variable message. And now we're going to input the next important part of the script, whatever variable you want to show up. Now in this case we only have one variable, so we're going to write my variable quest dot quest quest dot my variable. Hit compile scripts and what will happen then is the variable message will be shown and all that um, 0f percentage full stop bit that I wrote in before will be replaced with the variable my quest, my variable quest dot my variable, which is increased every time you offer to pay 100 caps. Like that. So, that, yeah, that's pretty much all there is to that. You just gotta remember how it works. You can, it might not necessarily be paying off variables you might have set. I, I don't know, you might just have some variable that you want to demonstrate whether, I mean, some mods track friendship points with characters, you might want to show you the points like that. I, I don't know, it's entirely up to you what you do, but as long as you remember, the two important parts are the lines of script that I wrote, showing the message, and then the line of script that I included in the message are the two bits that are most important to this, uh, to this, this part of the mod, this part of the process. So, that's everything, hopefully this tutorial was clear, because it can be a little difficult to do this kind of thing when like there's not a clear objective because obviously what variable you want to show is very subjective but um, hopefully that was clear anyway um, thank you for watching uh, goodbye